Well, it might just be happening. First Hurricane Fiona hitting Canada, and now Hurricane Ian roaring up into the Gulf with much Florida in its sights. I, firms, and carriers have informed me that they're mobilizing their cat property teams to start staging up near the coast. If you're a new adjuster or you've got some experience but you've never worked a hurricane before, this could be your big chance to get in the game. In this brand new Adjuster TV video series, learn how to earn more on a major hurricane deployment, starting now. You're watching Adjuster TV, adjusters first. Adjuster TV is brought to you by Kaplik. Learn all about E&O and other insurance for adjusters at cplic.net slash adjuster TV. And by Adjuster TV Plus. Get unlimited access to a growing library of the best adjuster training videos created by the most trusted name in claims, Adjuster TV at adjustertvplus.com. Hey, Matt here, and welcome to Adjuster TV, where I share my more than 20 years of experience as a cat property IA to help you build a rewarding career as an independent insurance adjuster so that you can help people during natural disasters and earn a great living doing it. Okay, the math here is very simple. In order to earn more, you need to close all the claims that they give you at the start of your deployment, and then you need to be assigned more new claims on this same storm, okay? Do not worry about the fee schedules, how you split it with the IA firm, hourly versus component. None of that stuff matters if you can't close any claims, let alone a bunch of claims. This is the secret sauce of independent cap property claims. It's a volume play. You need to be able to start closing claims your very first day in the field and then ramp up to closing multiple claims every single day you're on site. The more claims you close, as long as they're of good quality, the more claims you're going to get and the more you're going to get paid. So for example, if the average fee bill you get per claim is 350 bucks and you close six in a week, then that's 2,100 bucks. If you're brand new, that's actually pretty good for your first week ever. That's one closed claim per day for six out of seven days. But you can't stay at one or two a day for very long, maybe a week, 10 days, then you're gonna have to hit the gas pedal. Once you ramp up, the absolute minimum you need to be shooting for closing every single day is four a day. And with weather delays and office days and things like that, you're gonna be able to close claims five days a week. That's 20 closed claims in that week, which is seven grand. Do that two weeks in a row, and before taxes and expenses, that's 14,000 bucks. If they gave you 40 claims to start, and you do this right, you should be done with all those claims by the end of your third week on site. They're absolutely going to give you more claims if this is you. This makes you stay on the hurricane longer, okay? This will also get the attention of your direct manager and likely your direct manager's manager. They're gonna see you closing claims and they're gonna see that those claims look good, at least good enough to get through carrier QA, which means that you're likely to get asked to stay back and do cleanup, which you will do if they ask. And the longer you stay on this hurricane, the better you're going to get to know your IA firm and carrier managers, the trainers, etc. You're building relationships here. You're demonstrating that you're a reliable asset who's getting the work done. And this is wonderful for your career. After a few months, the work on the hurricane is going to start to dry up. And then there's an intense but not huge winter storm up in the Northeast that nobody else hears about. Take a little of the money you earned on this hurricane and buy yourself a parka and some mucklucks because you're probably gonna get called for that storm. This is all well and good, me saying this, right? But the doing of it is a different story and that's why I've put together a brand new three-day series of videos explaining how to earn more on your first or second or third hurricane with a special bonus fourth video. So in the next video, I'll explain how you can start piling money into your very first paycheck with same day closures. And then because the vast majority of hurricane claims will also have interior damage to at least one room, in addition to all the exterior damage, I'll show you three ways to scope the inside of houses and buildings faster and with more accuracy than just using a tape measure and graph paper. Close more claims by spending minutes scoping interiors instead of hours. Then in day three's video, I'll show you my favorite speed hack of all time, Xactimate macros, and why and how you should be making your own. And finally, as a special bonus, get a tour of the finest property adjuster training and certification program that exists, and it's helped dozens of new adjusters crush it on property deployments. Plus, 
a special discount just for Hurricane Ian. This new series is practical and actionable, and it's free. Go to adjustertv.com slash hurricane right now to sign up and get exclusive access to each new video as it comes out this week. And as always, thank you so much for watching and have a great storm. Adjuster TV. We snore so loudly that it scares everyone in the car we're driving.